Right, so Slipknot are becoming more of a farce than an actual band. I mean, just this month they fired their drummer Jay Weinberg, who had pinned with them for nearly a decade. But therein lies the problem. Who really cares anyway? The guy was far from being an original member and could never have truly replaced Joey Jordison in the band's eyes. As you know from my other videos on Foreigner and Kiss, I am really pissed at bands diluting their lineup with hired guns. And that's exactly what Slipknot are doing. The band's devoted fan base deserve better than this. You know, the phasing out of what was once great with, pardon the irony here, faceless mercenaries. This is a band in danger of becoming a franchise. You see, when Paul Stanley and Gene Simmons hint at and toy with the idea of Kiss becoming a touring band of contractors behind the makeup, people just roll their eyes because everyone knows it's only about the money for Kiss these days anyway. Even hardcore fans don't care because they checked out years ago after Peter and Ace left. But Slipknot should be better than that. It should mean something. It should be important who's behind the mask. What it shouldn't be is a watered-down travelling freak show of hired guns. And that, unfortunately, is what it has become.